Damn it, man! That was our ride! You just stunned our ride! Ah, <sighs> great. Ah! Run! I call you me, Lanto! I call you me! What the hell did you take? I have no idea, but they were bowing to it! Kirk to shuttle one! Locals are out of the kill zone! You're clear! Repeat! Spock, get in there! Neutralize the volcano! Let's get out of here! Captain, the shuttle wasn't built for this kind of heat. Captain, did the indigenous life form see you? No, Mr. Spock, they did not. The Prime Directive clearly states there can be no interference with the internal development of alien civilization. I know what it says, which is why I'm running through the jungle, wearing a disguise. Now drop off your super ice cube and let's go. Kirk out. You're good. We're gonna do this. We gotta do it now. This ash is killing our coils. You sure you don't want me to go instead? That would be highly illogical, as I am already outfitted Stop. in heat resistance. I was kidding. Uh, you got this. Guys, we have to go! Now! They're trying to cut! They're trying to cut, Jeff! I'll see you in 90 seconds. to save this species. If this volcano erupts, the planet dies. Cool, back up. Now! Surprisingly, alive. Stand by. We have to get him back. I'll suit up. I'm gonna go down. We have to abandon the shuttle. We can't just leave him, Sue. We don't have a choice. Uhura, I'm sorry. Spock, we're going back to the Enterprise. We'll get you out of there. Captain, I'm ditching the shuttle. You gotta make it to the Enterprise on your own. Wonderful. Uhura, you ready to swim? I'm ready. <laughs> Is that way? I know we're not going to the beach. Oh, no, no, no. I hate this. I know you do. Ridiculous it is to hide a starship on the bottom of the ocean. We've been doing here since last night. The salt water's gonna rule this. Sally! Place. Where's Spock? Still in the volcano, sir.
Engage! Lieutenant! We have an open channel, Mr. Spock. The heat's frying his comms, but we still have contact. Spock! I have activated the device, Captain. When the countdown is complete, the reaction should render the volcano inert. Yeah, and that's gonna render him inert. Do we have use of the transporters? Negative. Not sir. with these magnetic fields. I need to beam Spock back to the ship. Give me one way to do it. Uh, maybe if we had a direct line of sight, if we could. Hold on, man. You're talking about an active volcano, sir. If that thing erupts, I can't guarantee we can withstand the heat. I don't know that we can maintain that kind of altitude. Our shuttle was concealed by the ash cloud, but the Enterprise is too large. If utilized in a rescue effort, it would be revealed to the indigenous species. Spock, nobody knows the rules better than you, but there has got to be an exception. None. Such action violates the Prime Directive. Shut up, Spock. We're trying to save you, damn it. Doctor, the needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few. Spock, we're talking about your life! The rule cannot be broken under any circumstances. Spock! Try to get him back online. 90 seconds to detonations. Spock were here and I were there. What would he do? He'd let you die. Captain, you let them see our ship. Oh, he's fine. Right to Captain Kirk. Yes, Lieutenant. Is Commander Spock on board, sir? Safely and sound. Please notify him that his device has successfully detonated. Did you hear that? Congratulations, Spock. You just saved the world. You violated the Prime Directive. Oh, come on, Spock. They saw us. Big deal. Wake up! <laughs> 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 <laughs>